driver of the true car, Lucas Oil, Shea Holbrook in the Honda Civic this year. Shea, what got your start in racing? Oh gosh, what got my start in racing? Well, I grew up a competitive water skier, um, and I made a very odd change over to, I, I traded in my pair of skis for a set of wheels. Um, I started in a Richard Petty experience. Um, I was not quite a racing fan, um, contrary to belief. Uh, I didn't watch racing. I wasn't um, really quite even into cars, per se. But I was 15 years old. I did a Richard Petty experience, um, shotgun. And boy, was I in trouble, and my parents in trouble. I started doing um, SCCA club events. I uh, started out as well doing some chin high performance type stuff. Uh, wanted to make sure that I got a proper race craft underneath my belt before I jumped into really you know, doing some professional racing. 2010, I debuted my Pearly World Challenge series, and um, it's been really cool ever since. You know, we started a one-car team, um, you know, Shea Racing in support of Shea Holbrook, and pretty much around 2012, we kind of looked at it and said, you know, we could branch out, we could become a multi-car effort. So in 2012 was our first multi-car effort, and we ran two Honda Fits and a Honda Civic, and this year I'm really, you know, pleased to announce that I'm back into a Civic. From the new Touring Car A division, that blue and white Honda of Shea Holbrook went into the lead. Right now, my sole focus is my True Car Radium Lucas Oil Women's Sports Foundation Honda Civic SI. Um, I just created a great relationship and partnership with Women's Sports Foundation. Um, I was fortunate enough to receive a grant from them to help fund my racing, so a huge um, thank you to them. And it's been quite a journey. I look at what we have now and where we came from, and you always want more, um, but when you take a step back and you slow down for a second and stop you know, bouncing off the rev limiter, you realize that you've got really great people and great sponsors behind you um, and supporters and fans. So I've, I'm just forever grateful to the people that have helped us get here because it's not a one woman show, that's for dang sure. <laughs> In the new TCA category, Shea Holbrook held on for the win, it was that close. She'll get third in TCA. On board with Shea Holbrook getting the win in round number five in TCA. Oh gosh, if I wasn't racing, what would I be doing? I don't know. I mean, my, the, the best answer I have for you now would be, you know, I'd be on a boat in the BVIs, you know, just living the sailor life. <laughs> Look at this field. Audis, Bentleys, Ferraris, Porsches. Rally World Challenge, if I could drive any car, oh gosh. You know, I'd really like to get in those McLarens. There's something different about them. The GT3 format is... I mean, it's mind-boggling. I'm a kid in a candy store there, um, although I am, I, I do favor my Hondas. I love my HBD Honda racing team. Shea Holbrook in that Radium True Car Lucas Oil Honda Civic SI has checked out. 5.9 second lead over second place Jason Cherry. Brilliant drive by Shea Holbrook. This is what she needed. I drive an Audi A4 on the street and that thing needs some help, but you know what? I have put all of my money into racing, so, but it does exactly what it needs to do. Shay, you made it two in a row here, swept the weekend, now four race wins for you. Tell us how that race was for you. I'm sorry, say that again? It just sounds so good. Uh, <laughs> I'm just, I'm ecstatic. Um, we had some points to make up and I came into this weekend with a positive attitude that we were going to be able to do that and we came out on top. Um, I can't thank my guys enough. This race in particular, the car was just like spot on. Thank you so much guys. There's so many people that I need to thank. Um, my parents for, for one, um, they have been so incredibly supportive and as you know, I, I co-own the team with my dad and there's a lot of, uh, you know, when you co-own a team with your family, it's different. At the end of the day, your family. We experienced the highs of highs and the lows of lows together, so I am just forever grateful to my parents. Um, Women's Sports Foundation, True Car, Lucas Oil, Radium, they have been avid, avid supporters and our not only success but our growth as a team and as a business. Um, they're in the fans. I mean, the fans have been very supportive of us throughout the years, especially this year. I know that we've gotten them excited and um, maybe we've set some high expectations, but we have high expectations of ourselves, so we hope to deliver. Shea Holbrook wins TCA. This is really unbelievable. I'm sorry, I'm getting emotional. You stick your camera in front of my face, I get emotional. This is what you ask for when you have a girl, right? Um, this is for the team. This is for my crew chief and my boyfriend, Nick Torley, uh, my parents and all the guys that have made this possible and my sponsors. We did it, <laughs> we're doing it. It's been a, quite a ride for us, uh, a huge learning experience, but this year I'm very certain that we are going to be at the top of the charts in the Pro Light World Challenge. 